Hey guys, this is Steve. This is the um, the club trainer um, blade ozone quadcopter, the one that's on sale for forty nine dollars right now. Um, without a transmitter or battery, you get the bind and fly edition. It's a one eighty size one S brush quad. It takes a little one S. Uh, 500 milliamp battery. I have a 600 in here, a little bit oversized. Uh, this is the club uh, transmitter we use for the apprentice. So we also, so now we have a training quadcopter to learn how to hover and stuff. I'm going to give it a quick test flight here in the backyard, um, and we'll see how it does. Let me see something here. Cool. Let's give it a try. I may edit out the long wait here. So you have on the transmitter, you have this button just arms it. And then you have two, two flight modes. There goes the noises. Um, so you got uh, like an acro mode and a self leveling mode. I'm going to fly it in acro mode. And we'll give that a shot. So this arms it. And you can fly. Well, we got about probably five to seven miles an hour wind out here. Gust to seven, ten at top, but average three to five, and gust from seven to ten. So this handles the wind or a little bit of wind just fine, and it's good for outdoors for sure. Try to keep it closer into the camera so you guys can see it because it's tiny when it gets out there. Very quiet. Those are manual flips. You're not hitting a flip button. You're actually flying it just like it's an airplane. You, know, you can do those fast flips, or you can do a nice, kind of a slower, a little windy, but slower turn like that. Slower flip, they say turn. This is great for uh, learning how to fly a helicopter nose in, where all the uh, you know controls are backwards. It's getting hit with about seven miles, six miles an hour of wind right now. It's a little bit gusty. You can see the trees moving back there. So it handles the wind, a little bit of wind just fine. There's about 10 miles an hour of wind right there. So I'm, you know, battling. Yeah, that's easily 10 miles an hour of wind right there. And, you know, no. No problem once you get used to the wind. So the helicopter definitely can fly in it. That was fighting the wind a little bit coming back, but you can do it. We'll bring her in for a nice nose-in landing here for you.